What's up, guys? Welcome back to our Zombies Challenge series. And today, we're gonna be hitting the mystery box every five rounds and seeing how far we can get. Now, if that sounds familiar to you, that's because we've done this challenge a few times here on the channel. But today, we're gonna be switching it up a bit. The few times that we've done this challenge, we did it on D Machina, and I kind of leaned heavy into using Shatter Blast. It kind of carried us all the way to round 100. So today, we're gonna be playing on Firebase Z, and I'm gonna say that Shatter Blast is off limits. We can't use it at all. All right, so I decided to start this game with the size and Tesla Storm. I think Tesla Storm will help me get a lot of points fast. We're gonna need a lot of points points for as much as we're gonna be hitting the box and the size are pretty fun here on firebase c you can do this little skip here to get to the first portal without buying the door which is pretty cool so i always like to use those any chance i can get but normally when we do these challenge videos i usually take suggestions from you guys and we go off a top comment from our last challenge video and i still want to do that but for our last one i didn't really know how to do that challenge so first of all our top comment from the last video was from hollow whisper and they said they want us to play on the darkest map with like the lowest brightness settings and everything which i think is an interesting idea but i just don't know how to you know stretch it out into a whole video and have it be like viewable because if we are playing on, on the darkest map with the lowest settings i feel like you guys Guys won't really be able to see what's going on it's just gonna be like me on a face cam on like a dark screen so obviously for the map it would have been like mauer but after that i didn't really know where to go from there so if you guys have any uh suggestions on how to add more to that challenge or something i'd be down to revisit it but i just wanted to shout out how whisper there he did get the top comment so i did want to give him his credit but i just didn't know how to do your challenge man i'm sorry but the reason i wanted to play on firebase z today is because it's gonna be fun to see what weapon i get to fight order with because order starts showing up at round 30 and he shows up every 10 rounds after that and i just really really hope i don't have a melee weapon when he when he decides to show up like we're gonna need to get some nice luck to be able to take him out and also this is my first video i've recorded in like a month uh, i recorded a bunch of videos in bulk and went on vacation you know took a little break took a step away so i'm sorry if i'm a little rusty here but i figured i'd add baptize myself in fire uh fire baptize myself in firebase z actually and try to do like a round 100 challenge but we just hit round five let's go ahead and see what our first weapon of the day is gonna be all right box help me out here what are we getting okay the c58 not bad for our starting weapon it's got a thermal sight on it though so maybe i take that back maybe i take that back at least we only have to use it till round 10 so it's not awful but hopefully the box starts treating us better when this game progresses and we also got to get power on so i'll start up this first generator oh man thermal looks so cool but it is so inconvenient to use in zombies oh no don't knock me already we're not doing this this thing only has 20 bullets in the mag too <laughs> what an awful first weapon and our first reactor is complete let's grind the rail oh that was bad one more time one more time grind the rail we'll take it start up our second generator and reactor number two is complete let's get this one started oh, wait what does this mimic look like in thermal terrifying uh-uh nope you need to leave right now you need to make like a tree and get out of here thank you and reactor number three is complete all right so what perk should i start out with what's going to help me out the most here i'm thinking dead shot i am playing on keyboard and mouse so i don't get that little aim lock boost to the dome but i do get that critical damage boost and a boost for hitting zombies repeatedly so that'll help me out a decent bit and then i think meal kick will probably help too oh no Okay, well, later, Mule Kick. I'll see ya. Gonna have to self-revive. So it's round six and we've already gone down once. This is gonna be a long day. Going down is something we're gonna need to avoid, obviously. But it's so much more fatal to go down in this challenge because it not only takes away our perks, which we're gonna have to spend money to get back, but then we have to we lose like a, a good portion of our money that we can be spending on getting our weapon and getting it pack a punch that we're going to be switching out so often. So I really got to tighten up here. And since we did just go down and I don't have enough for a self revive, I'm grabbing quick revive. I should have grabbed that first. And I think up until like, I don't know, maybe round 25, I'm not even going to pack a punch my weapon. I guess depending on what we get. All right, while we're at it, I'm going to save money where I can. Let's try to go ahead and do our bunny Easter egg so we can get free jug. All right, let's go ahead and take these things out. Nice and easy. See you later, bunny. We got one more. There it is. Good night. Oh, no, I can't aim. I said, see you later, bunny. There we go. All right, let's open up our reward chest. We can only grab jug from this, regardless of what weapon comes out. Oh, it was M16. That's a nice weapon, too. All right, well, we'll get a perk for free anyways. Okay, I think this is our last zombie of round nine. Thank God. Good riddance to the C58. Let's switch this out. Give me something good, please. Please. Oh, the AMPs and their dual wield. Let's go. That's exactly what I'm looking for in a gun. Too bad we got it so early. Hopefully we can 
repull these later in the game. Actually, I'm going to go ahead and put in the rule. I think I put this in in our, our older challenges before. No repeats. If I get the same gun twice, I just switch it right back out. So actually, if I do get the AMPs later, going to have to get rid of them. So it's a shame that we got them so early. If I want any hope of getting around 100 before I'm like 40... I'm going to have to start speeding these rounds up. We got our first assault wave here. First of many. These ones don't have Orta though, so it should be pretty easy to deal with. Knock on wood. And it was just as easy as I thought. All right, AMPs. It was fun. What's our next weapon? It is... Oh, the Groza. Not bad. We'll work with this. How's it do against these zombies? Eh, that's pretty decent for a non-pack-a-punch weapon. It's getting like one tap headshots almost. I think it's about time we grab a few perks. Let's get Death Perception and Elemental Pop. Now, I did say no Shatter Blast when I started this challenge, and I didn't think about Elemental Pop having the chance to accidentally use Shatter Blast. So I'm going to say Elemental Pop is okay, considering I don't have Shatter Blast on my weapon. But, you know, to counteract that, I think I just won't put any ammo mods on these weapons in general. So the only ammo mods I'm getting is all random chance from my perk. Oh, is that a nuke? Give me that. Oh, that ended the round. We need to go get another gun. All right. Round 20. What weapon do we get now? A bullfrog? Eh, not bad. We'll take it. Ooh, this thing is not looking too good, especially against armored zombies. Oh, this is bad. Well, I might have to start pack-a-punching sooner than I thought. Oh, but this thing does not do well against elites at all. The bullfrog already has some of the largest clips in this game, this one being 65. I put a whole clip into that manger, and he's only half health. Half health. No, 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 no. Stun. Go. Another stun. Go. Get me out of here. Another one, please. Oh, that was close. Good thing we had them stuns. Oh, yeah. We've definitely hit a damage wall. This thing's doing nothing. Gonna go ahead and pick up Mule Kick again. Hopefully, I don't immediately go back down. But Mule Kick's gonna save us a lot of money on ammo in the long run. All right, round 25. What's our next weapon? Give me something good, please. Oh, the bunny. We got to find where the next box location is. The box didn't go too far away, though. What are we getting this time? Okay, the FFAR, not bad. One concern I have, though, since I did grab Mule Kick, is that this is my third weapon. If I go down, I lose my FFAR. So what I'm going to do is buy this AK wall buy. Leave my size on the ground. Now that the AK is my main weapon, I'm going to put my FFAR on the ground. Pick the size back up and then switch the AK for the FFAR. All right, now it's back to our number one slot. How's the FFAR doing against these zombies without Pack-A-Punch? Uh, not very good. So I'm going to go get Pack-A-Punch for it, I think. Let's grab it real quick. Try not to die. Exit the menu, please. Run. All right, Pack-A-Punch tier one seems to be doing pretty good now. What perks are missing that we need? PhD. And that's it. Tombstone. Fuck off. Might grab it later, though. All right, we are very close to hitting round 30. So I went ahead and I switched my field upgrade from Tesla Storm to Ring of Fire because Ord is going to be showing up any second now. He could show up next round or within like the next five. So hopefully we actually get something that can shoot Orda and we can put this Ring of Fire to use. And hopefully I don't regret switching out that field upgrade. We might have to switch it back later in the game, but let's see what we're getting now. The KSP, oh no. It's got to be like my least favorite SMG, but we're going to have to make it work. We're going to have to get a pack a punch while we're at it too. Leave the menu! Oh, I, I hate those menus. It doesn't matter if I, like, try to back up. If I try to hit escape, it feels like I always get stuck in them. Oh, no. And this thing is not very good against these zombies either. Oh, it's barely even doing damage. And we're stuck with this for the next five rounds? That sucks. Oh, round 32 is when Orda decides to show up. All right, buddy. I think I might need Pack-A-Punch 2 for this, so I'm going to go ahead and grab it. All right, KSP. If there's ever been a time for a gun to prove me wrong about itself, it's now. Let's try to take out Orda. We're not doing a whole lot of damage at all. We're doing probably 765 per bullet in this three-round burst. I mean, it's not awful. It's not great either. Oh, this is not looking good. Oh, he's critting. How much do I do on a crit? 848. Not bad. Not awful. I mean, okay. You know what? I'm coping. It is kind of awful. And right, we have another ring of fire. Please crit for me, Orda. Help me out here. Please. Any, any little bit helps. Here we go. Let's go. 1500 with ring of fire on the crit. Oh, they're already hitting the reactor in here. I didn't even know. Leave it alone. Oh, I don't think we're making it, boys. I don't think we're doing it. Oh, this is a big yikes moment. Let's give it a, a few more shots into Orda. Never mind. He's taking over our reactor. Our first battle with Orda. Big L. I might need to get pack a punch three on these Orda rounds, but these are going to be so tough. This was probably going to be our easiest fight against them, and we just got demolished. It's only going to get worse from here. Now we got to turn it back on. Damn. And we got it back on. 
Ooh, these are going to be tough to get back on in these high rounds. All right, Ring of Fire experiment is over. I'm back to Tesla Storm. All right, round 35. What's our next gun? Please help me out here. Okay, RPD. Not awful. And they gave me the world's longest scope for this thing. Why? Why are they doing this? All right, I already went ahead and got a pack a punch too. And it still does not do that much damage. I really just got to go for headshots here. And they all got to be hip fire because there's no way I'm using this thing. Especially with how slow this scope's in. Oh my God. This would have been nice against order though. I know this would have done the damage. All right. Round 40. What weapon's next? The hand cannon. That don't count. We got to do it again. What are we getting? The bunny. Great. We have to wait for the box to move. What is our next weapon going to be? Oh, the Tech 9. Been a while since I used this bad boy. Oh, no. It's a single fire Tech 9. Why? Oh, and it's not good at all. Oh, actually, it's doing all right. It's doing decent for no pack a punch, to be fair. All right, let's grab pack a punch on this bad boy. Grab two. You know what? Let's get three on this. We're going to have to fight Orta pretty soon here. We're going to need all three pack punch tiers. Is it good against zombies, though? Heavy zombies? Maybe not. Normal zombies? Yeah, it's pretty decent. Okay, Orta fight number two. The Tech 9 was really good against Orta in the past, but I'm pretty sure that was only the full auto version with Ring of Fire. We have single auto, no ring of fire. Can it do something here? Where are you even at? There we go. Okay, it actually does pretty good against them. 1500 damage per bullet? That is not bad at all. I wish I had ring of fire. You'd be sleeping. What does it do against this crit? Can I even hit it? There we go, 3000? That's pretty good. The tech nine is still a really good weapon. Okay, we got them under half health, but they're doing a pretty decent job at taking out our little reactor here oh yeah crit for me there we go that's what i like to see oh this could be it come on please i think we got him we actually got him let's go the single fire tech nine can take out orda no ring of fire get out of here all right so we failed our first order attempt won the second one let's go get out of here all right tech nine it's been fun what's our next weapon no not a sniper. These are about to be the longest five rounds of my life. I think I might be okay leaving this a pack a bunch too. We can save a little money here, but as long as I hit my shots, this thing should be a one hit kill to the head of any zombie. Sucks that doesn't clap more than like two. Oh, what does it do against elites? Mangler, if you could. Oh, it does nothing. It does fuck all. So that's fun. No! What? How'd I go down? You better let me back up, Mimic. One of these zombies better let me back up, please. Come here. No way Electric Cherry didn't get you. Get back here. Come on, Quick Revive. Help me out here. Might have to... Oh, there we go. I was about to say, might have to use that Self Revive. Didn't have to, but we did lose every single one of our perks. This is why we we're stockpiling money. This is why we do this. Because now we need to use about... Oh, shit. How much is it? Like 75,000 to get all of our perks back? That's an expensive down. I'm just going to have to run and train until... I get this round dwindled down a bit so I can get my perks back safely. Or at least I'll do it until I get Tesla Storm. That's probably smarter. No, 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 no. Stun. Oh, I still went down. So that's two downs. Not good. Zombies, I need you guys to get the hell out of my way. Oh, this is not good at all. I just need like one more kill for Tesla Storm. Okay, maybe one more. No, no, no. 60 health. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Come on, cough the Tesla storm over already. There we go. Finally got it. All right, let's head back and get our perks. All right, let's pop it. Give me literally everything back. I'll even take Tombstone at this point. We just burn through a good portion of our cash. Give me the self revive and let's get out of here. That was way too close for comfort. Oh, finally. My five rounds of torture is done. I don't ever want to see a sniper again. Where's the box at? I don't even remember. It's been like a half hour. Those five rounds took so long. All right, please. Anything but a sniper. <laughs> okay, EM2, not bad. We'll take it. Nice change of pace. Oh, yeah. This is so much better than a sniper. It may not do the most damage, but it's better than shooting one shot every three seconds. Okay, Orda, if that's your real name, let's see if you can survive the EM2. Oh, the EM2 does decent damage against them too. Definitely shoots a lot faster than the Tech 9. This might be a lot higher of a damage output than we've seen so far. This might be the best yet. We already got him down to half health. Oh, is he critting? Let's go. 3,800 per bullet? 
That's crazy. All right, Orta, thanks for stopping by, but I think it's time for you to leave. Damn, okay. So back-to-back -back weapons that we had against Orta did really well against them. We take those. See you later, bitch. All right, EM2, it has been a pleasure. Please give me something good in return. The Ray K, let's go! Get to use a wonder weapon for a little bit. And right at health cap, couldn't have picked a better time to get it. This is gonna be fun. Fun. This is like my least favorite wonder weapon in this game, I think. Uh oh, I might go down here. No, I'm chilling. I'm chilling. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. Stun. Stun. Why am I so good at cornering myself? Okay. Woo. All right, I'm out of here. I can't train down here. But this may be my least favorite wonder weapon in the game because of how slow it is to use and switching all the ammo modes, but I'm so glad to see it here. But this thing absolutely melts once you get the orb going. Shoot one of them bad boys down. Switch your firing mode. Everything just gets eviscerated. Those mimics just got frozen, basically. No, and we still went down. Oh, for one day, I would just like to not be stupid. Just for one day. Just want to see what it's like. Good thing we already had a Tesla Storm. That makes getting all these perks back much easier. But we are getting extremely broke from this. We are just at like 200,000. Now we're only at 80,000. So I cannot afford to go down again. Oh, no. No! Oh, I thought I got out of it. How do I go down twice with the Ray K? I might actually be the worst zombies player to ever live. Come here. Come here. Please let me get electric cherry on you. Nope. And I'm out of ammo. Gonna have to self-revive. Well, that sucks. <sighs> we'll get all of our perks back again. Took a little armor. And we're good. Actually, we need one of these too. There we go. Now we're good. All right, Ray K. I'd say it's been a pleasure, but it really hasn't because I'm awful. Give me something different. No. No. Not the DMR. I don't think I've ever used a DMR on this hive around. This is ridiculous. Well, I can't really say anything about it until I start using it. What's it like? Not good. Does not seem very great. And this is what we're gonna have to use against Orda. This is gonna be a nightmare. All right, moment of truth. Can I take out Orda with a DMR at this hive around? Where are you even at? Okay, all right, actually. Damn near 2,000 damage a bullet? That's not bad. I'll take that. Oh, wait. Why is the damage going down the closer he gets? Why is that a thing? Do I have a long range bonus with this? Is that what's going on? Yeah, the further back I stand, the more damage I do. I've never tried that before. Let me try to stand as far back as I can while still being able to see him. Oh, that's crazy. Let's kill these zombies. Please give me a Tesla Storm. There we go. Let's try to hit his crit from back here. Oh, 3,200 for a crit shot. We only got one in there, but we'll take what we can get. Stop walking towards me. We got him just under half health. Oh no, he's about to start super sucking. Stop it. Oh no, that's a crit. Keep going. He's so low. Come on. No, now he's about to super suck. Can we stop him? Let's go. Get out of here. Whew. Just barely got him. That was so close. No, 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 no. What? I was hitting like a DMB drop right there with the amount of times I was saying no. And they still did it to me. There we go. Got up. Finally. We gotta bite the bullet and buy all of our perks back. We're only at 67,000. I cannot go down again. This just got so difficult the further we get into this. These zombies are not playing around. The DMR was honestly pretty impressive. Let's try and see what our next weapon is. Oh, the zombie's waiting for the box too. Oh, too bad it was a bunny. All right. What do you got for me now, box? Be nice. Death machine. Don't need that. Need something different. What now? What do we get? What do we get? What do we get? No. No. Not the iron hide. The ZRG of shotguns. This thing's slow as shit. Oh, my life is going to be miserable for the next five rounds. Does it do better pack a punch at least? Not really. It's like using a sniper all over again. No. Oh, come on. That just might be the down that does it for us. No, 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 no. We're not going down on insta-kill. Not again, not twice. At least not right in a row. But buying all of those perks back might just take up all of our money. It's going to be tough to pull ourselves out of this. Okay, we can get them all back, but we only have 30,000 left. It's actually a lot cheaper than I thought. But 30,000, not a whole lot to work with when I have to pack a punch three another gun in five rounds. Or four rounds now. No, not again, not again. No, no, no. No! No way it happened again. Okay. We're very low cash. We gotta find a way back up. 
There we go. We have a Tesla storm, so we can get our perks back, but we're going to have like what? 10, 20,000 left after this? Let's see. Okay, we got them all back. We have 14,000. Zombies, please let me the fuck out of here. All right, I said we couldn't afford to go down again. Looks like we could, but now we're really screwed if we go down. Let's go. We made it to the sex round. Round 70. Ironhide, it's time for you to fuck off. What weapon are we getting next? No! Oh, this thing takes eight business weeks to fully reload. How am I supposed to do this? Oh, this thing's hot ass. The mangler's just eating these shots. If I have to use a whole mag of a street sweeper to kill a mangler? Oh. I can't believe they're doing this to me. Oh, shit. I forgot about Orda. How the fuck am I supposed to kill Orda with this? Huh? Tell me, Mimic. All right, well, this should be interesting. Can I even hit him from back here? Can I hit him from the back? Yeah, these do not reach. So that's fun. Maybe I have to give it a little drop. Nope. We're gonna have to wait till Orda gets closer. For now, I'll just work on taking out these zombies. Can we shoot them now? Are we close enough? No. Okay, there's no way he's too far away now. There we go. Get him in the kneecap a little bit. Eh, that's actually doing some pretty decent damage. Oh, 2,000 damage to be precise. Oh yeah, crit for me. Hold on. Give me like two weeks to reload. That's 4,000 damage per shot. Okay. That's doing all right. I can just keep these fucking zombies away from me. Come on in, Orda. Okay. Half health. We got him half health. No. No, 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 no. Shoot him in the dick. Oh, uh, no, it's too late. All right, well, straight sweeper against Orda. Uh, then, I mean, uh, it's it's decent, but there's not enough time. You win this round, Orda. It's almost more difficult trying to turn the power back on over here. Oh, and I'm out of ammo. Great. Fantastic. If this power does not come back on and we go down, there's no way of us getting our perks back. It's just chalked. No, they broke it. How the hell am I supposed to turn power back on on round 70? Oh, this is tough as shit. No, no. <gasps> No way, we just went down. This can't be fucking happening. This can't be fucking happening. All right, I'm using my self-revive right now. Come on, we gotta get this power back on. No, it's so close. I just can't kill him fast enough. No, they stopped it again. No, what's a man to do? No, now my armor's busted. Let's try this again. Some of these zombies just need to drop like a nade or something. This is ridiculous. No, Mimic, no! Oh, I gotta get up. I gotta get up. Come on, quick revive. Come on, quick revive. I can't even crawl right here. Please, bro. It's not looking good. Oh, come on. Can a zombie please come over to me? Oh, I'm fucked. Come on, crawl faster. Crawl faster. I gotta be able to knife this guy. No, this can't be happening. No. Oh, no. Come on. All right, well, here's our final stats. We made it 72 rounds, 7,156 eliminations, 1,481 crits, and 10 downs. All right, well, we didn't make the round 100, but making it into the 70s doing this, that's pretty good. Considering we get a random weapon to fight Orda with, we couldn't get him with a street sweeper, and that ended up just killing us in the long term. Like, that is bad. I didn't realize not killing Orda and the power going out and us not being able to get perks back was just so detrimental. Like, it's just a domino effect of not beating Orda to us losing the game. But with that, I'm going to go ahead and end the video here. So if you guys like this, you want to see more, go and leave a like on it. If you didn't and you don't, dislike. If you're new here, please start subscribing for all kinds of kind content throughout the week. If you want to keep up with me outside of YouTube, go ahead and check out my Instagram and Twitter. But I think that's going to be it for today. I'll see you guys next time. Later.